Lord, use me, use me to tell my story. Spent so many nights in pain that I cried myself to sleep. But you brought me through and spared my life so I can help somebody else fight. So Lord, use me. Brian C. Jones, Senior Minister of the Newburgh Church of Christ here in beautiful Louisville, Kentucky. You are about to see some messages of hope. Yes, we're talking about giving you some hope. There's so many people that have went through so many arduous situations in their lives, but God has brought them out and brought them through. There have been some miracles that have taken place right here in the Newburgh Church of Christ among the Newburgh nation. So sit back, relax. You're going to get some motivation and some hope. We give God praise for our sister Cassandra Hatton. Harris, Sister Tisha Butler, Brother Troy Marables for the wonderful job they have done with putting these videos together. Each week, you should get a powerful video to encourage you to keep having hope because the Lord can perform miracles. God bless you. Hi, I'm Gloria Battle. I've been a member of the Church of Christ for over 50 some years. I've been a member here at Newburgh for quite a few years. I'd like to share with you all that I was diagnosed with cancer, breast cancer, on June the 5th of 2017. I shut down, I didn't know how to respond, so I just didn't say anything. But the, my doctors and the people that were over me told me that I had to share with my family because my family was my support. So I did tell my daughter, told my husband, my daughter, and of course, my husband was with me the whole time. And uh, I had to go for a consultation June the 14th of 2017. And that's when they uh, explained everything to me, how I was gonna, uh, what they were gonna do for me and all and such. So I had surgery on June the 20th and they told me they would call me a week after my surgery, but they didn't. I was sitting at my dining room table having dinner, and they called me. It was three days, not a week. And I hollered, oh, thank you, Jesus. I got so excited, and I was so happy because they told me my test had come back negative. And I'd like to share with, with you all that sometimes you might not know how you're going to respond but that's okay. It's, it's such a blessing that God took care of me the whole time, and I knew he did. So I want to just praise him and thank him and thank Jesus for walking me through that. And I want to encourage others to please hold on to hope, the hope that we have in Christ, because he truly does take care of us. And also, I want to thank him for my church family, for the prayers, and for everybody that did such wonderful things for me. And also, I would like to share with others that just go and get diagnosed and keep do your mammograms and early detection is the best for you because it was the best for me. Don't hold off, don't wait. Don't say, I think I'll go, just go. And thank you, God bless. Lord, use me, Lord, use, use me, me to tell my story. Spent so many nights in pain that I cried myself to sleep. But you brought me through and spared my life so I can help somebody else fight. So Lord, 